What's going on guys, Zedia Fliptronics. I'm gonna be going over if it's safe to buy crypto on Robinhood in 2021. Now there are some pros and cons to using the crypto here, which I'm gonna go over. Now you can see my account's got around 80,000 in it, but this does not include the crypto. I don't know why, but they don't pull up like your whole balance if you hold crypto, uh, you know, when you log in. So, you know, 80,000 in stocks, I put 30,000 just recently into Ethereum, and uh, I'm kind of hoping for a big move there. Now, as I'm going over this, if you guys want to get started on Robinhood, I'll have a uh, bonus and um, some resource links in both the description and comments of this video, so you can get some uh, free stocks. Currently, there's seven cryptos that you can buy, sell, and trade on Robinhood. So, one of the downsides, obviously, is they don't have a lot of crypto coins, um, but if you're looking to buy like the basic ones, which might not be a bad idea if you plan on holding them for a while, like Ethereum, for instance, uh, then, you know, it's basically the same as the stocks. There's going to be no fees for buying or selling. So you can see right here, I purchased, I think it was like 29,000, something like that, kind of close to 30,000 of Ethereum, kind of at a higher price point. And uh, I'll let you know my thinking in just a second here. Now, Ethereum has yet to break its all-time high of around like $1,400. So a lot of people are speculating that the coin is going to double basically in the coming weeks and probably like less than a couple months. So I decided to make a play at it. You know, I put a, put a good amount of money in it, trying to double up, make a quick like 30,000. We'll see what happens. You know, obviously it could go the other way and I could lose, but you know, I'm going to definitely hope for the best on that. But my thinking is that, you know, Bitcoin... It's broken its all-time highs. It's basically like doubled it. Uh, and Ethereum being the second most popular coin has yet to break its all-time high. And a lot of people have noticed that. So I'm not the only one out there. Uh, but you can see I actually own some Bitcoin on here like a little bit. And, uh, you know, I'm not too big on Bitcoin, honestly. I kind of prefer the altcoins. But, you know, I do own like whatever it was, like seven or nine bucks. Uh, but other than uh, Ethereum, and this isn't financial advice, guys, but I would actually recommend checking out some dogecoin if you do plan on getting some crypto on here i mean i wouldn't buy a ton of it but dogecoin is like one of those coins that could really you know kind of moon higher than it has uh and uh if you don't know what it is i just wanted to pull up their website real quick it's basically their mascot is the shibu inu and they've got like a ridiculous video that i'm gonna play here so let's check it out Man, I got to tell you, I never get sick of watching that Dogecoin trailer clip. It is absolutely ridiculous. And Dogecoin is known as the joke coin in crypto, but for whatever reason, they have it listed on Robinhood. But I think it could actually go up to like, you know, three cents in 2021. So uh, bottom line, is it safe to buy crypto on Robinhood in, uh, you know, this year? Absolutely. You know, if you're just getting into it, I'd recommend sticking with like Bitcoin and Ethereum, uh, but obviously you can see I made my play here trying to uh, make a quick double up on Ethereum, thinking it's going to get to, you know, maybe 2,500 bucks pretty soon. You know, uh, I think you get between like three and 5,000 in uh, 2021. Like I said, not financial advice, but we'll see what happens. Okay, hope you guys enjoyed this. If you could smash the like button, subscribe to the channel for more crypto content, and we'll see you in the next one.